Reading. Do you like reading? Well, yes, I like reading very much. I always do some reading before I go to bed. Why do you like reading? I like it because I can get a lot of new information from books. I know what life is like and get the experience of others, which will be useful in my life. What kind of books do you read? I like to read biographies because they are instructive. And they teach me how to face the difficulties in reality. Where do you read books? Most of time, I read at home. The best place for reading is the balcony. I sit in my armchair and read my favorite books. Sometimes I read in the municipal library. How do you get the books? I borrow books from libraries or download the ebooks from the internet, and I read on the computer. I also go to the bookstores to buy bestsellers. How many books can you read every day? Well, I can read about only one chapter every day. I'm a slow reader. Besides, I don't have so much time for reading. Do you like to discuss the content with others when you read books? Yes, I like showing the essence of a book as my friends. We discuss the opinions of the author and see whether it's the reality or not. I think this experience is inspiring and instructive. Reading is an active mental process. Reading makes you use your brain while reading you would be forced to reason out many things which are unfamiliar to you. In this process, you would become smarter. Gives you a glimpse into other cultures and places of the world. Reading gives you an insight the diversity of a necessity of people, their customs, their lifestyles, etc. You become more aware about the different places and the code of conduct in those places. Improve concentration and focus. It requires you to focus on what you are reading for long periods. Unlike magazines, internet posts or emails that might contain small chunks of information, books tell the whole story. Since you must concentrate in order to read, like a mess, you will get better at concentration. Build self-esteem. The more you read, the more knowledgeable you become. With more knowledge comes more confidence. More confidence builds self-esteem. So it's a chain reaction. Since you are so well read, people look to you for answers. Your feelings about yourself can only get better. Improves memory. Reading, although not a game, helps you stretch your memory muscles in a similar way. Reading requires remembering details, facts, and figures in literature, plot, lines, themes, and characters. Improves creativity. Reading about diversity of life and exposing yourself to new ideas and more information helps to develop the creative side of the brain. You always have something to talk about. Reading, why doesn't your horizon of information You'll always have something to talk about. You can discuss various plots in the novels you read. You can discuss the stuff you are learning in the business books you are reading as well. The possibilities of sharing becomes endless. Reduces boredom. One of the rules I have is if I'm feeling bored, I will pick up a book and start reading. What I've found by sticking to this is that I become interested in the books and subject and stop being bored. I mean, if you're bored anyway, you might as well be reading a good book, right? Reading is beneficial for both children and adults. It can help you to cope with stress and anxiety and provide a form of relaxation and escapism. It is also a great brain tool, helping people of all ages to learn and develop important life skills in terms of education self-improvement, positive life choices, and all-around well-being. Children and adults can read to develop their language, vocabulary, and all-around comprehension skills. Spelling and writing skills are also improved by regular reading. Thanks for watching.